Hello, hello guys! Uh, good morning! And we are back para sa ating key number 2 ng first series natin. Team Spirit, a uh, beautiful start for the opening series today. Tingnan natin kung uh, kaya ba nilang i-2-0 yung LGD or mabafocus at playing game number 3 natin dito. LGD grabbing out Doom and Techies para sa nilang opening pick. We have Team Spirit with the Ember Spirit and then Bloodseekers. So, uh, waiting pa tayo dito Thank for you. the uh, fifth band on both sides. Tingnan natin. Pero ito yung nagpanalo for Team Spirit kanina. So they're just trying it out again for this game number 2. And yeah. uh, for LGD, different approach yung gagawin nila for this game since they have Doom and Techies. So Team Spirit, they're just banning out heroes na ayaw kalaban ng Bloodseeker. So Medusa and Juggernaut already removed. Uh, and it's gonna be that faces Void 5th ban and uh, for LGD, Well, you just need to ban out support heroes or kahit offlane siguro since we're not two more heroes already for uh, Team Spirit. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Dying's turn to pick. Radiant's turn to pick. Well, Undying will be pick for LGD. It's a strong leaning hero, that's it. But uh, Doom, Bloodseeker, parang kawawa sa Bloodseeker. Eh. Ten seconds. Parang yes, pero we every, have ano, heroes, malakas sa lane. Eh, parang every Five strength hero na mataas yung HP, parang kawawa kay Bloodseeker dahil sa shard, tsaka ags. <laughs> mm, and lagi pa naman yung kinukuha agad sa Bloodseeker once available. So another clockwork for uh, Mira. Kapag nakakita ko ng mga, alam mong makunat na hero, parang, okay, Bloodseeker game na ta. <laughs> Clockwork, another uh, hero from the previous game. Ten seconds remain. Saya ka ba? Five Hindi na makangiti, idol. <laughs> Oracle. Oracle, para sa side and team spirit. So, they have something to protect someone who will get doomed by uh, new so okay na tong oracle pick para sa akin ha doon na sa blood seeker like Second. sa team fight di ba kayang makasurvive ng blood seeker kapag nakakuha siya ng mga last hits Five. tapos naka false promise times 2 yeah. yung uh, lahat ng hill eh, no? Yeah, so we already have initiate for team spirit and someone to save with the oracle and for lgd we're just looking for the fourth pick So, one of bang awin hero sito. Well, uh, they'll go for Haskar mode green for LGD. Haskar just to answer the Ember Spirit onto the middle lane. Pero meron tayo yung uh, control for Team Spirit to stop the Haskar. You have Clockwork, you even have Orahal, and yung main problem talaga ito for Haskar is yung Bloodseeker. <laughs> Puro strength hero si meron yung LGD. So, Shard of Creed. Palu-paluin mo lang ulit yung kalaban. Kagano ko ulit. <laughs> <laughs> Parang wala ka naman kasi any disables talaga for LGD to catch the Bloodseeker. Yun yung problema. Tapos may ola ka na pa sila papatay yung pag-askar ka. <laughs> Sinong, okay, parang yung inisip mo sana maganda hero for LGD is someone to jump on the backline since you already have all the Hall for Team Spirit. Pero gusto nila yung Sherwin sa lane. Why not go for MK instead, di ba? <laughs> Parang feeling ko mas okay pa si MK kasi... Wala ka naman problema sa Rapture. Pwede kang tumayo na lang inside your ring. Pagalita mo. Five. Ano ba LGD? <laughs> Nothing to do. <laughs> well, uh, okay Nothing naman, di ba? Sa lane stage, Oscar up against Ember. That might be the reason why. Pero yun nga. Um, Fates Edict this game is pretty insane. You're dealing with Techies and Oscar. Fates Edict is an upgrade version of the BKB right now. <laughs> <laughs> Kasi yung Fates Edic, 100% yung magic resist. <laughs> so, talagang uh, walang damage. Yung uh, magic damage sa'yo. So, well, although, hindi siya yung uh, debuff immunity. Ando pa rin yung mga stuns. Yes. Pero yung damage ng mga skill, aside from pure or physical, yan. Guaranteed na block naman ng uh, Fates Edic. So, I think Burning Spear, magic damage pa rin naman siya, di ba? Yep. And, uh, and actually, for... laging ganun naman siya. Eh. 
si Haskar. Yung usually overall damage niya sa Burning Spirit. Eh. Hindi sa dry clicks niya. Eh, no? Parang pag nag-build up yeah. yung Burning Spirit. Dire must choose. And parang isang face edit lang yun for the order. But then it's going to raise our last pick for Team Spirit. So mode Amar naman dito yung Team Spirit. Pero yun for this game, I think sobrang ganda na ito for Team Spirit. Parang kung malapitan mo lang yung Haskar, there's no one to save him. And for Team Spirit, hindi ka rin naman matataka pumasok anytime. As long as nagkakaroon ka ng magandang position for Oracle. Which is for sure na pwede mangyari. So wala naman tayong panghuli talaga on the backlines for LGD. Unless magkaroon tayo ng magandang safe in hero. So what's with Razer this game? Kay Haskar. K2. Ay, hindi. Feeling ko kay Haskar, hindi. Min Burning Spear pa rin. Hindi rin naman siya yung... Pero kasi pwede yung... Pwede no? yung sa bagay. Wala lang, parang Pero momentum parang, lang. Pero parang para here's the same team spirit. Yeah, parang pwede pang random na kasi here's the team spirit again. Parang yung key item mo lang naman for the racer is yung BKB and once na magkaroon ka ng BKB, mm -hmm. pwede yung ganun lang ulit yung gawin nila just like what happened in game number one. Since LGD they went for Naga Siren on the last pick, sobrang bagal ng timing nila on the zeros. You have Doom and Naga Siren, they're just gonna farm. Unlike Team Spirit, pwede silang uh, lumaban na lang every time you have Mira on the clockwork again. Pero depende siguro sa middle lane. Well, you have Ember Spirit against nothing to, uh, I mean, uh, against the Scar. So, siguro ito yung isa sa mga lane na kayang i-win out talaga na LGD. Pero pag hindi pa nag-work out yung Haskar mid, parang ang hirap ng game to for LGD. Sobra. They really need to take advantage of the Haskar pick. If not, scaling-wise, um, kahit sabi natin mayroon nagasaran for LGD, much scarier for the Bloodseeker. Ano, no? Like, Mjolnir may... carrier kasi yung Bloodseeker, di ba? Mjolnir sabay Alks. Tapos mayroon ka pa ang side of Fist on the Ember. Si Laurel pa yung Ember. But at least for LGD, meron naman silang way to save someone. You have the tombstone from Y, maybe song from the Naga Siren. Wala lang. Parang, ang di na natin masyadong ma-figure out is yung Razer. Na parang typical na lang, uh, lane, hero, na okay, malakas, pwedeng uh, mag-snowball, di ba? Kapag nagkakaroon ng magandang uh, start, nagkaroon ng early items. Ano yung item build niya, no? Uh, wala lang. Ang cute lang. I mean, Five dreams uh, ba to? <laughs> bigyan na pa Razer ng wala lang, no? In deep spirit. Pero tigyan natin. I mean, uh, kung kakayanan niya ba sa power spike yung Huskar, di ba? Yung static link na sinasabi natin since meron naman siyang Eye of the Storm. Maybe it's not about the damage reduced on the Huskar. Maybe yung yeah, damage armor, na meron yung, yung Razor against Huskar kasi sa armor reduction. Yeah, yeah. Pero for the Razor, meron, I mean, uh, okay pa rin ba yung Bloodstone on this hero? I'm not sure. Parang medyo confusing kung ano yung magiging item build dito ni Collapse eh. Ano ba nangyari? Ba't ba na wala yung Bloodstone approach for Razer? Wala lang, hindi lang talaga siya hindi sobrang valuable talaga. Hindi ko rin malahal eh. Hindi naman siya parang nag-nerf. Parang bigla na, na siya naglaho eh. Hindi lang talaga siya yung sobrang daling i-work out. Kasi yung gastos din niya eh, no? At the same time. And then hindi rin siya yung typical offlane hero na hinahanap din naman natin. Use it wisely. Yeah, okay pa rin naman itong magiging match natin for both teams. That was both play on both sides. Think of that then. Fortune Sand over to the Techist. Blood rate for the follow up. Battery Assault. And this should be the first blood. Para kay Yatoro. Si Yatoro pa ngayon ako ng first blood. So good start again for Team Spirit. They can even contest this. Bounty rune. Parang iniisip ko kanina for Team Spirit, mas okay yata kung kuha sila ng offlane hero na pwede mag-isa. Parang yung idea yun. Parang kailangan mo tulungan talaga yung middle lane.
So for the Pantaloons, magkakalabo pa tayo ng uh, next team fight. Max at Fortune Sand. Wala nga lang tatamaan. Well, three bounties. No, three bounties plus spirit. Three bounties plus first blood. One key go lead agad. Wala pang creeps. Solid. The boy wants first blood. Give, Give the, the boy first the first blood. Wala, ano tayo team spirit LGD. Maga muna. Maga. So, uh, Larl up against NTS once again. It's gonna be a favored matchup for the Huskar, obviously, with a Burning Spear para sa first kill choice. Hindi ba inner fire? Inner fire! Pang last hit? I mean, level 1 Burning Spear, wala kasi damage din. Like, it's a sabi ko, dati, pwede ka mag-salve sa level 1 Burning Spear. Pero kasi kasi bawal na, pero now, now he says it's level 2. So, he already has his uh, inner fire. <laughs> Nag-inner fire na ba siya? Actually, Berserker's Blood. Berserker's Blood. Well, uh, at wala least eh. attack speed. Wala eh. Nag-expire na kasi siya eh. <laughs> <laughs> Parang panindigay mo na lang eh. <laughs> Kasi wala ka na yung Burning Spirit kapag wala kang uh, Berserker's Blood. Like, yeah, wala ka na yung attack speed. Tsaka, pabawas na pabawas sa buhay mo, kakabata ng Burning Spirit. Tapos wala ka pang regen in Berserker's Blood. <laughs> Actually, kahit anong level pala ng Burning Spirit dati. Hindi talaga naka-cancel yung solve kasi mababa lang 20 <laughs> Pag max out Pero ati cling on to Y We're just trying to get some uh, damage for collapse to secure these last hits Aha uh -huh. so, Last hits in deny, hindi lang naman yung gagawin ni collapse dito Just trying to contest this one For Yatoro yeah, at least, medyo malakas na yung uh, lanes ng LGD up against uh, Bloodseeker compared to game 1 natin. Okay na, Tekis naman yan. Kaya yun nasa Phoenix eh, na parang wala siya masyada ma-provide eh. Yep. Masyado kasi yung passive talaga yung hero. Yung Blast of Connects onto two heroes but we don't have any follow-ups. Pero good damage pa rin naman onto Yatoro. It's a way to pressure him pero make sure na hindi siya makakuha ng last hit sword na yun. Kasi makakapag-heal up pa rin naman dito si Yatoro. Conditions will be cleared out for high collapse. Okay, Ami, well, up until now, wala pa rin naman. Sadyang magalaro lang siya dun sa... Pero kasali siya ng Asian games, yun, no? Asian games, yes. Yeah, Good luck. Yun lang, yung alam natin. For uh, Ami. Kampi niya sila, Somnus. Parang dating LGD, tsaka... Saan din na si Shinkyu, eh, no? Hmm, si Shinkyu, saan din. Pero ba't kayo hindi nagkutotay si Shinkyo? Nakas na lang nag-pause for noon. Ewan, di ko rin alam. Hindi ko alam ko anong sinabi niyang recent batch at umigil eh. Di ba sabi niya babalik lang siya kapag bumalik siya, no? Si... Ay, talaga ba? Fate, Fate Bian? Fate Bian, oo. Parang yung siya. Kaso parang ang labo lang si Fate Bian, ayun. Oo, no, no, tagal na rin ni Fate Bian. Nag-champion na si Fate Bian eh. Oo. Oh, nanalo ka na rin ng Riyad Masters. Nanalo ka na rin ng TI. Kaso yung panalo kasi nila, wala lata silang nakuha ang pera, diba? <laughs> Oo, oh, yun lang. Yun yung <laughs> wala kang nakuha ang pera, TA champs ka. Ang ano mang pera. Yung wings. Solid yun eh, sarap panoorin. Eh, yun yung time na walang meta heroes. Parang, oh, sa jungle uh, lang talaga yung ginagawa nila. Oo, oh, magulo yung Kaya parang game exciting. nung time na yan. Kaya, parang... Unpredictable. Sayang na walang true sight pa ng mga panahon yun. Pero yung mga ganun games yung may magandang true sight sana. <laughs> well, may still 1-0. After yata nun, no? Nung major, nung sa... Hindi, yung... EG pa yung ngayon start ng true sight eh. Sila RTZ. Hindi ko lang alam kung anong tournament yun. Hindi, yeah, tama. After nun. After nung TI-6. Like, pagdating ng mga major ng time na yun, nagkaroon na ng true sight. True sight tsaka Red Bull, no? <laughs> yung sa Red Bull, yung sa OG. <laughs> yung Red Bull, yun yung nag-champion kasi yung OG. Yung to the Red Red Show, no? Solid din yun, eh. Savior of OG naman yun. Yung Start... sa Give the Boy in Bower. <laughs> <laughs> Start ng true sight, EG tsaka Fanatic, di ba? 
Uh, major pa yun eh. Qualifiers ng major lang yun. <laughs> diba? Ano, regional Para qualifiers. Para yun yun eh. Regional qualifiers eh. Well, that's gonna be a dying dead. Have zero at five minutes. So a decent thing, man. Yung nangyari to for Team Spirit. Sila lang talaga yung mas sacrifice. Pero at least for the Ember, nagsiring chain side of his naman siya. So with this spell, siguro once mag level six siya pa nasa mag rotate on the side lanes. Yeah, most likely. And actually, he's setting towards top. Ano ba siya magagawa dito? His siding. His level change. four, actually level four Ember, rotating on top lane. They do found the Nagasara. Nice change. Well, si naman mag expect si ba? <laughs> Ember Spirit level four. TP. I mean, I'm going onto the top lane, and that gives the free lane onto the Scar. Not even sure. I mean, wal asin pang farm yung Ember kapag ganito yung uh, skill build. So, di ko lang kung paano siya makaka-recover. Kundi siya yung makakakuha ng last hits. Diba? Parang ang hirap. Elimination round. Yes, boss. Elimination round tayo. Lower bracket tayo ngayon. Puro lower bracket yung cover natin ngayong araw na to. Fortune Zend, once again. Nan sa pag-gression for the side of Team Spirit. And uh, for why? He'll use the decay. Connects over to me, Poshka. But that's only one hero for the side of Team Spirit. And 4-0 agad starting early stages but for NTS it's looking good so far uncontested for the Huskar so at least diba itong uh, at least work pick, on diba? the goods yung pero siya yung siguro once na siya ng armlet doon na tayo mag expect ng uh, oh, movements from LGD kasi wala talaga ang gagalaw on this game wala apat na lang talaga inisip ko lang talaga paano ba yung recovery for the younger Mula rotation nang talaga on the side lane sayo. Pero yung problema mo kasi yung side lane sa so pumunta may snaga siren. Parang ang hirap nito patayin later on. Siguro yung doom pwede. Yeah, pag na rupture. Uh, reserve mo lang yung uh, searing chains mo kasi most likely TP out na naman yung nagiging answer sa rupture. Well, pero Vanguard is already up for new. So back to farming lang ulit for uh, both sides, we still have this 1k gold lead pa rin naman for Team Spirit. So Silar is still playing around the top lane, still trying to take out this Naga Siren. They have the observer rewards, so wakita naman nila dito yung tunay. So Searing change to next, and Shiro is with the target again. I have to start from Colas at multiple TPs, we have nothing to save with the rotation. Now Blast of Sun connects on to two, there's no way out for the Ember, same group for uh, Mira. Well, he do manage to TP out. Hindi naman enough yung damage from that uh, Burning Spear. Pero Larl, with that failed rotation. I think okay lang. I mean, uh, for them, it's like, kung may mamatay, si Larl na lang siguro. Kasi hindi pa naman talaga siya maasahan ngayon. <laughs> Parang wala ka pa talagang aasahan eh, no? Mm -hmm. So, as much as possible, wag lang mag-slow down yung Bloodseeker and the Razor, di ba? I think good's name for Team Spirit. Kung makakakuha naman ng kill kasi dito si Larl, Malaki naman yung makukuha niya kasi sobrang behind niya in terms of net worth. Doon na niya sa XP. Solid na solid yan kung sakaling makukuha siya ng mga kills. Just needed level 6 for the Ember and uh, I think pwede na siya na mag-start uh, mag-rotate-rotate dito. May push ka. Pete Selic over to the Huskar. And uh, just a couple of uh, seconds to disarm him. Static Link! But we have our inner fire and our rapture that we have to say, and uh, there's nothing to do. It's nothing to, fight to do back. for nothing to say. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're going to Oscar, and there goes Larl with the level 6 available. Gotcha, why? Too dead for the side of LGD. Much bigger trade secured for the side of Team Spirit. But we have more heroes in Team Spirit. Dun. Alam ko na to. Alam mo na ito, boss. Pahinga ka muna. Fortress end. New. We have the cogs to drop him inside. Blood rate task connects. Movement speed given para kay Yatora. Should be plenty enough to take him out. Di na ako umabad yung slide of this. Di pa na nasa ni Lord. Yeah, ngoy. 
Minsan na lang. Minala. Eh. Minsan na lang pumunta eh. Ari ko. <laughs> Puta dyan siya electric pan na walang harap. <laughs> Sol. <laughs> Kasi. <laughs> Matalo lag lag na yes. Elimination tayo lahat for uh, today. Lahat ng games na cover is lower bracket. So it's do or die for uh, LGD. So at least for Lars, na ako naman na siya ng Javid. Onting taste na lang for that mail storm. Mas sa mawon yung item na to. Ano na siyang tool for farming? Lasa siyang point on ano yun? Flame guard. Kaya mong hirap dito. Talaga ito lang. Ah ah ah! Sa katalaga siya mga kills on the enemy heroes. Yan nga na siyang level one flame guard. Or NTS dito. Going for BKB for his next item. So, 11 minutes in for our game natin and 7-3 in score. Tamang yeah. plasma field. Plasma field lang naman para kay Collapse. Well, even though we have enough one kills for our team spirit, we're not going to be behind. Talaga dito yung LGD. Pero yung problema is ang yaman ng blood seeker. Eto yung magiging problema talaga mamaya na LGD. But with the smoke play, they do manage to find you. And then you will just stand past the vanguard. The Taurus not going for the dive. Eh, medyo risky rin. Like meron din tayong ultimate para sa doon. Pero sakto din yung Raptors sa tornado niya, no? Kabawas agad eh. So uh, at this point, hook shot tatama over to the techies. Well, solo naman yung impact ng ating uh, or yung target ng ating uh, battle result. Pero naman tayo pa rin naman clockwork. Same goes with techies. Before Kadito will be tipping his way out. Magin may enough. Let's give him a double kill. Or uh, nothing to say. Nice Pero parang ang pangat nito eh. No? Parang for Haskar. Like a low HP. Oh. It means that it's always fast, but the top lane collapsed. We'll try to go for a TP out as well, but I think we have enough time here to take him out and log with the TP. What can you do? We don't have any items yet. But that's the goal from the tombstone. Yeah, it's a bit of a bit of a LGD Dito in terms of pickoffs. So they're getting the kills that they need. But the main problem is... It's just like Roshan, right? They didn't slow down the Bloodseeker. And that's gonna be a pause. This is what you're saying, idol. Okay. Okay. It's hotel time. Hotel gaming. Okay. Hotel, hotel major. major. Let's go. Let's go. Tignan nga natin, boss. Tignan natin, boss. Wala. Wala yung live, ba? Wala. Napahala ka na lang, no? Ma, hotel major yan. Wala. Ala, hotel major it is. So, ano pa meron? Ano masaya si Nabe? Di ba nagpost lang automatic kan? Oh. Ah. Ati ko ano mga problem for both sides? Ba meron lang problem sa mga tech internet baan nawalan din na internet hina yata ng internet connection siya yun kahit ako nawawali yun nakakawa pa dahilan tagal na ito bossing road to 2 hours ulit 2 hours 3 hours Hindi, feeling ko hindi naman tatagal lang ganun yung game eh, no? Yeah, Siguro mga one hour. Oh, boy, Malabong yun. umabot Kung ng ganun. Kung Huskar ka, no? Tapos ang tagal yung game. Mag-enjoy ka pa ba, no? 
parang wala ka nang mamamicro micro ng ano mo ano na ganito kalaban mo blood seeker siguro <laughs> kung si queen ka mag-enjoy ka pa si scar enjoyer talaga yun it's not in the same parang yun kasi nakita mag scar wala na talaga parang ano na yun, hindi kasi no? bagay sa kanya yun no? parang weakness ng team spirit yung mid kailangan nating uh, magkaroon ng magandang uh, matchup di ba para kay shutdown yun na lang yung mid so uh, having a scar is not a bad idea look at this Sobrang behind ng uh, Ember Spirit natin. Pero one good thing about the Ember is uh, one death pa lang naman siya. And still continuing to progress. So for Desor, talagang ano naman. Going for BKB with Power Threads, then going Halberd afterwards. So good naman tong ganitong approach for Desor. So dyan, uh, mahirap dito yung Bloodseeker, no? Kapag uh, LGD ka. Parang lahat kayo. Pwede, pwede kayong uh, patayin ng Bloodseeker. O parang paano mo siya bigla ang huhulihin na yun, no? Well, kape muna tayo, guys. Sa mga gusto magkape dyan. Uy, nag-resume uh, na sa wakas. Ay na, we're back to the game. Doon sa mismong live. <laughs> Para sa atin, di pa. Mamaya pa, boss. Tignan mga ano, um, almost 15 minutes pa yung antay natin. Feeling ko lang, ha? Tambay muna sa saglit. Tambay lang muna tayo. Pakumain pa ng alian. Baka nga, boss. Okay. Pero ang, ang, ang weird kasi, di ba? Wala silang sinabing reason kung ba't nag-boss. Oh. Sino ba yung nag-boss? Uh, si... May posh ka. May Wala rin disconnect sa nila. So, ibig, ibig sabihin, hindi naman siya yung lag issues or anything. Pero ang tagal kasi nag-inabot. production mismo yung merong problems. Uh, I don't know. Na pinahinto muna nila yung match. Pero pag kumabot ba tayo ng late team, sino ba may advantage? Parang team spirit, spirit pa rin eh, no? Para saan team spirit? Parang for LGD, kailangan nila mas snowball yung game with Ascar. Kung sakaling hindi nila nalubi yung Ascar, sa ganyan ito, ang uh, hirap na agad ito for LGD. Kaya talagang ang laking bagay nung... So, hindi lang nalubi yung Ascar. Sobrang nalubi yung... Ay, yung Ascar talaga, yung Ember, di ba? Sobrang nalubi yung Ember spirit. Grabe yung uh, difference ng network niya dito. Just Pero kahit is nalugi siya, no? Yung problema, yung side lane sa mga team spirit is gumagana. Ano lang yan? Para kasi yung mangyayari, thank you, thank tatlong core you. hero yung LGD, dalawa lang sa team spirit. Yun, panalo si Shiro sa roll. LGD na to, pag gaganto. <laughs> uh, paano ba yung roll? Ayun, nag-roll. Paano ba mag-roll? Roll lang. Roll slash, lang nga. Like, ano na? Dash? Hindi, slash. A slash? Ano ba yung slash? Kaso hindi ka pwede mag-roll eh. Hindi ba pwede mag-roll? That okay. ata, teka, try kayo. Di ata oh. eh. Ayun natin yung oh, spectator okay. siya. Wala pa din. Not what you expected? Guys, let me... Top tower, please. Need Maelstrom. Thanks. So, ayun na. Mingi na ng uh, tower si Larl. Larl, tama na. Game 3 tayo lang. Teka, timbla muna ako ng kape. Medyo matagal pa naman tayo. Alright, alright. Thank you, thank you. Bye-bye. Mid, feed me one time. I'll let you tap tower. <laughs> Still on the code for our Ember. <laughs> Alam, nakatawa yung mga ganito, yung mga friendly conversation between uh, pro players, lalo na kung uh, hindi naman sila same ng nationality. 
<laughs> we give you clock. <laughs> I mean, na- nakakatawa lang, di ba? Huwag ka na-enjoy nila yung game kahit uh, rivalry nga yung dating Anete, Spirit LGD. This will please the gods. Oh no, I'm level seven. Not Mira. <laughs> Lugi is a trade level six class is Mira. Actually, malapit na rin pala yung Maelstrom ng Ember Spirit. 300 gold. He'll be getting his Maelstrom soon. Hello, boss. Hello, boss. Hello. How was that good? Great na mga chat nila eh. Ay lang. Nagkaroon sila ng friendly chat. Classic LGD. This is the spirit. Sabi nila, win TA first. Hindi, charot lang. Wala pala siyang sinasabi reason, bakit? Wala. Ah, product. Ah, dahil yata oh, sa production. Sa production Kasi nag, eh. nag-off, eh. nag-off yung stream. Kasi wala Hindi naman sinabi. Hindi niya nabasa ko yung sabi, nag-down daw yung stream eh. Kasi so usually kapag nag-post yung mga player, hmm. mag-stay tagal ng reason. Hindi yung sinabi ka mo ni Lalke Collapse, ang cringe niya daw. <laughs> May isang interview kay Lal. Tinatanong ng interviewer kung sino daw yung parang joker daw. Si Collapse daw yun. Pero sobrang cringe daw. 
Tagal na. Malapit na, malapit na. Konti na lang. <laughs> Lapit na ho. Medyo nakangiti pa ho si Sherry. Tae. Wag. <laughs> Please, wag. Don't do that. Para kong sumashot like <laughs> pag ininom ko kape, too big. Kaya mo. Kaysa ko too big, alak ka. Solid. Pag ganyan timpla na ng gin. Ang haling tapat no. Gin coffee. Gin coffee. Bigyan <laughs> na ata eh no. Gin na, ano yung gin gin si ito hindi ko pa natitikman yun. Kung ano mang halo yun. Meron pa gin chaki ba yun? Hindi ko hindi ko maintindihan yung top nung ganun. Gin Milo. Ay, parang sakat sa chan nun sobra. Iniisip ko pa lang. Kasi sa normal na chai pa lang, sumasakit na yung chan. Mayan mo pa ng gin. Solid. Mga naiisipan, lahat pwedeng ihalo sa gin. So, bagay sa amin yung ginawa, gin red doors eh. Hey. <laughs> nilagyan nilagyan na ng juice. Like, parang pomelo, ganun. Ay, Ay masarap yung pomelo at saka strawberry. Gin. Pero may redders nga, gin redders talaga. Sinintihan? Hindi ko alam. Or hinalo lang talaga? Ayun, hinalo lang siguro ata talaga. Ano ba yung tat ng pagsindi ng gin para sa alcohol? Ayun ko, di ko ba na ko. Kayo yung marunong nun eh. Marunong ako, pero di ko alam kung bakit. <laughs> Nga ba, ginagawa mo, di mo alam kung bakit na. Oh, ay, yun yung kinagawa ng mga tao. Amazing kaya magsindi na ako ng gin. Oo, oh, wala akong idea kung ba't ginagawa yun. Pero, pero inisip ko sa alcohol. Kapag ginagawa na yun. Kasi di ba, ang sarap manorin ng apoy. Ay, ready daw. Alright. Thank you, thank you. Ako, oh, parang sasabi nila yung spirit of spirit of heroes. Spirito. Di ba sa first, ano yun? Sa first shot. Yung spirito. <laughs> Hindi natapon yung first shot. Sila pinagsabi. Ano daw shot? Hindi ko rin talaga. Pero, pero, pero may mga ganun. <laughs> Ewan. Yung laging iniwan yung spirito. Ewan ko sa mga nakatanda. Pero yun kung kung mamahaling alak, katapon mo yung unang shot. Di na, Di na uy. Kung mga JT block label yan. Si Ekner yun eh. Si Apuli. Hindi, hindi, hindi. Si Ren. Ah, si Ren? Oo, yun. Doon ko nalaman yun eh. Oo, kung nga parang kung nag-aano tayo natin sa Pacific, di ba? Parang laging may tinatapon. Tinatapon niya yung una. Doon sa may bubong. Di ba sa may bubong lang naman kasi tayo? Kasi pwede ka magtapon lang. Oo, kaya shut down ng demonyo. Parang ganda. Ibigyan mo lang yung mga demons mo. Ewan ko pa. The back on farming tayo dito, and uh, actually this is what they need for Team Spirit. Malapit naman na tayo sa PKB ng Huskar, and uh, yun lang naman. Pwede magdadiretso yung LGD afterwards. Yep, same goes for Team Spirit. Yun na din yung hinihintay na yung BKB, yung collapse. Oh, yeah. Kay LOL, wala muna tayong asan sa yun. Matagal na recovery pa yung kailangan ng MP Spirit is game. Tingin ko kaya niya sana kung yung support mo na yung Team Spirit is yung kaya mag-rotate talaga on the middle lane. Mga heroes like Ench. Kaso wala tayo. Ganun for Team Spirit. Mayroon ka support na parang members, diba? Like, Scarlet Mage yan. Pwede yan. Skyrat, yung may mga slow. Skyrat, Techies, Enchantress. Kasi yung ginawa niyang build, like, nag-early ceiling change sa data, wala naman magiging magandang follow-up. So, ang hirap din eh. Kaso yung Flame Guard mo yata kasi sa mid, parang ang bilis lang yata matanggal with the Burning Spear. Kaya parang pinaforce out talaga dito ng Team Spirit na gumawa ng play around the Ember. Pero yun nga lang, hirap kasi talaga gumawa ng target. Like Vanguard on the... Vanguard on the Doom, Shiro. I mean, pwede siya magagay ng point on the song, even have the illusions. Parang kakapusin talaga dito yung Team Spirit. Since hindi naman ganun ka-solid yung disable talaga nila. 
Like everything is dispellable. Yung uh, hookshot lang yung hindi. Well, at least naging okay naman yung early rotation nila sa top lane, di ba? Ano na, para sa support hero, three heroes na sa top. Pero ito, why dito will be spotted out by Mira. They have the uh, static link. Fortune send. And Never mind. the uh, dying down. Mira dito, well... Hindi pa binigay kay Lull yung tombstone. Yun Gamot lang. Gamot lang, no? Hindi na nga binigyan ng kill. Hindi mo pa yung bibigay yung tombstone. Bala ka dyan. Pero nakover ka mag-isa. Well, it's tayo. Tier 1 top tower might be the first objective that they have to get spirit. And uh, for LGD, it looks uh, wala naman ng uh, sense para to defend it. Okay, finally BKB is up for the Razor, but same goes with Huskar. How about Doom? He's going for Mech. Why is Doom here? I think Mech is already texted and pinned. So, uh... Casual Vanguard and Blink Dagger, so the usual approach that we do. We get that in the for this game. Yeah. The Halberd is going to be next item for NTS. Yeah, Sanj, extra healing. But we don't have a lot of Russian players right now. For the Bloodseeker, so 90 shard gain up compared to Axe. Yep, shard talaga. Para na 20 minutes, bilin mo na agad. Since you already have your BKB, you have protection onto yourself. So may attack speed ka naman na, de ba? Since sa milner naman yung kukuwain mo muna. So okay naman tong early shard upgrade. At ika masasulit pa naman to. But right now, it's less than one k lead for LGD. Well, look, shot onto natin si, pero kaya ba nila to? I mean, that's the problem we have BKB for not in safe to use. And Yatoro will fight against Hunter Say, has the stick, and Naku Puyatoro is here. Yeah, yeah. Masyadong malakas. Yung, uh, Ember Spirit and Collapse, he also managed to try with the other soul lead from White Sim and Ultra King for not in safe. And with that team fight, it's time for Roshan. Ay, ito na yung opening na hihintayin ng LGD. And actually, it's a bit full team, but if you have to mount me, Poshka, I didn't notice. Wala, wala pa attack speed si Bloodseeker. Parang isa-isa rin kasi sumugod yung spirit eh, no? Nice try, pero yun nga. Pero with that attempt, parang unlucky agad ng gold boost na yun for LGD. Sada na makakukuha pa nila yung Aegis dito. So, that's huge for LGD. Wala, pinapangiti ako ng LGD. Parang putang na to. Pinapangiti ka, no? Ina pa sa pa na ini. Ano naman ni? NTS naman ni. Tala. Para kaya kaya si nating kasi ano n? So BOT for the next item choice para kay Lord. I mean, I do get this. Parang kailangan nila mo na siguro mag split split, push out the uh, other lanes. Since uh, LGD gusto nila tapusin na yung game eh. Looking at their heroes with this uh, Huskar. Actually Huskar pala yung problem nila noon. What if mag-enable na rin yung Nagasara dito? So uh mas lalo may hirapan ngayon yung team spirit. Kasi dapat talaga nila yung items ng blood. Three core heroes na from LED in the interest of network. So for team spirits, it's really hard to initiate a team fight. Parang si Mira talaga yung pinaka magiging alay kito for team spirit. Pero kung dapat ini mas talagang naring Ember sa Huskar man. Yeah, since Ford Ford tig naman siya, no? Kaya tapos siya sa offing na kaya. Parang mas magu work out pa yun eh. Kung wala siya ng counter sa Huskar, di ba sa mid lane? Kung wala siya ng Viper. You know what, Nilal? And then we hear we had the Crimson Guard, but we are just allowed to take him out with Hero Ghost down. That's huge for Team Spirit, so um... Medyo nakabawi naman, medyo lang. Yeah, that's Nagasara and Dead. Medyo malaki-laking kill na rin yun, kahit pa paano. Albert available now for the Huskar, so uh... It should be good. Aganem Scepter will be the next item for the Clockwork. Yeah, 
Continuous pa rin naman dito si Antias. And scaling and going for assault Kiras para sa kanyang next item choice. Still not looking good for the side of Spirit boys and um di ko lang kung ano inaantay pa nila dito bukod sa items ni Yotoro. Since up until now, wala pa rin naman tayong impact masyado for the Ember. It's only level 12. Minus yung BOT nga lang meron siya dito. Wala pa nga siyang corrosion. Well, Raptor, it's on the planet. We have the Fortune Sense. Pero natin to say, he's finally here to protect down the tech. Is it gonna be enough? Nope. Yatoro gets the false promise. We have the heal and uh, change target. Goes on to Mira instead. Medyo natagalan dun si uh, Yatoro since tinitipid niya rin yung BKB niya. Kasi wala, kailangan niya na i-pop dahil na-disarm siya. Para hindi kasi, kasi worth eh, no? Ang annoying talaga ng tech is na mali-disarm ka every time. Malaking bagay ng reactive taser. Yeah, parang sobrang high pick talaga na itong Tegis. Parang ito na yung best version ngayon ng Tegis. Hindi, joke lang pala. Yung dati pa rin pala talaga. Yung green na bomba. Green na bomba. Solid yun eh. Landmines. Diba yung, eh, yung landmines? Yun yung solid na nakaka-depress eh. Yung kasi tutula yung... ka na lang, tapos bigla ka nang sasabog. Yung landmines kasi, kahit yun lang yung landmines lang papatayin ka eh. Sa inyo yung pwedeng mag-stack din yung... Nag-stack kasi yung landmines eh, diba? Hindi yung tulad ng proximity ah. mines ngayon. Ay, yung proximity mines nila, layo-layo eh. Pero pagka nabigla ka naman, pag pumasok ka, diba? Tapos yung danger din eh. Sa inyo dati. Sa inyo yung kaganda. <laughs> Physical damage. Nakaka-dip. Sobrang nakaka-dip. Pag level 1 kasi walang karamo-karamo rin yung hero eh. Buti pa yung ano eh, magic resistance. At least level 1, 25% magic resistance naman na meron agad yung heroes. Pero level 1, wala kang armor. Tapakan mo, tatlong landmines. Patay ka. <laughs> Nakatago ba sa puno-puno? On the top lane, Dumufius on to collapse. New is trying to survive. Andiyan pa rin naman yung Crimson Guard still alive. Soldiering for some heal. Oh my god, sinino ka ako. Oh. But New goes down. Still have the experiment for LGD. Pero parang at this point, parang dapat dati magkakasama na yung LGD. Yeah, it should be. Parang ito nga yung mga sense, di ba? On half... Pwede, 2610. Nag-chat siya, no? Maybe sa Aegis Expiration yan. Yeah. Aegis Expiration yan. Pero yung sasabi nga natin, like, Husker Aegis, try to play around with him. Get objectives as much as possible para lang magkaroon kayo ng much better map control. Para sa lalong ma-choke out yung heroes ng Team Spirit. Parang yun naman yung sense, di ba, ng having Aegis. Actually, nag-blink dagger muna yung Huskar. Hindi ko sure kung sobrang valuable ba ng blink sa Huskar this game. Wala ka pa naman ags. Or bagos niya talaga ang mahanap. Bagos niya ang talunan yung Oracle. Gusto ko nga akong ags eh. Parang ags pa rin eh. Mahal lang yung ags. Para atin is may stun. Pero di ba naman layo kasi yung cast range niya sa Agen and Scepter? Ano ba? So para ka... May cooldown reduction din yata yun. Never mind, wala pala. Yung taunt talaga yung importante. Like 3 seconds taunt duration. Duel eh, no? Berserker's Call. Kala mo magkaiba yun. Same lang naman na tonsyo. Same lang naman na papalo din sa kalapay. Ewan ko ba sa'yo? Makontra lang ako eh. Pumabawi ka. Parang ano eh. Yung kung pause for but he's nagging. Hindi. Hindi. Si AUI yung pause for but he's nagging. Siya, no? Siya pa tawag nun? Si IUV, no? Mine! Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Twenty-four minutes, and even like naman yung score natin, but you can't help and see na LGD dito yung merong advantage right now. Dahil nga mayaman dito yung tatlong core heroes sila. And as for the Ember, wala pa rin naman tayong uh, recovery for this hero. Meron siya 3k gold. I'm not sure kung ano yung purchase niya. He's trying to weigh kung uh, much better bang mag-radiance muna siya dito. And I think, for me ah, mag-radiance na lang muna. Hindi, nag-orb na siya. 
Wala well, nang bawian. Oh. Well, against life break and against zoom. Pwede. Yeah, good stuff. Then, pwede mo pong matulungan yung teammates mo, di ba? Pwede mo sa teammates ilagay yung uh, Lincolns. Well, Roshan's not yet up. 30 seconds pa, bago natin malaman yung uh, timer ng Rosh. And, uh, mal actually, malapit-lapit na rin tayo dito sa Aghanim's timing yato. Oh, meron na siyang short upgrade. Silver Edge ata, kailangan din ni Yatoro dito, but same goes with the MKB. So, a lot of items is needed for the Bloodseeker. Just to deal with the Huskar. Yeah, MKB not bad, kasi B-Fly carrier din naman yung, uh, mid, yung uh, Naga Saren. Pero, for now, hindi naman siya mag Oh, Tormentor dito. Oh, mga contest pa nga. It has been popped. Structure over to NTS. Miposhka, still safe for now. They even dropped the Thumbstone for this. Then, then the tamang Tormentor na lang for the side of LGD. Shard upgrade was given to Planet. So, ito. Ang laki bagay na ito. Reactive Taser. Bigay mo kay NTS, di ba? Ba't may Axe in Clockwork? Mayaman ang Clockwork. Direct na Axe, no? Ang nga. Ah, may pagkata ng Bestown din talaga. Ano yun yung Rocket Fair, no? May slow na rin kasi. Oh. Well, 90 gold for LGD and 50 seconds left for Roshan. So, nito pa rin naman yung map control for LGD. Still had the high chance na sila pa rin yung makakuha ng Rosh. Mabilis lang kumuha ng Roshan si Bloodseeker. Hindi ko magandang yung shard yun. Nag-doom siya. Pero may Lincoln Spear na sila. Outplayed. Baka Lurgan sir. Lurgan with the Lincoln Spear. Rupture over to Shiro. Actually, did he take BKB? That's very unusual for Yatoro. But I think he's probably going to die. I feel like he's not enough damage to take him out. Maybe he's got a Aghrim. Maybe he's got a Aghrim. I mean, there's no harm in trying, eh? Yep. You don't have to call him BKB, but why not? Uy, shoutout nga pula, uh, nga pala kay uh, Jolo Viesca, yan, from Kabanatuan. Good afternoon po, and uh, welcome po sa ating stream. We already have 28 minutes para sa ating game, and 10k lead for LGD. Roshan is up, waiting for it. Might be LGD for the one to uh, grab this. NTS going for... Uy, yun, may Aghanim sa turn na, so ito na, mas... Mas lalo nag, naging sulit naman na yung Blink Dagger niya, di ba? Since nag-agonims na siya instead of AC. Pero he needs Assault Keras. I'm not even sure kung ano yung magiging item na tatanggalin niya dito. Kung uh, Drop Boots para kay Huskar, yung ba yung magiging play? Blessing. Bibili ng Blessing yan. God bless. Roshan, Parang ito na. kailangan mo pa rin kasi na movement speed for Huskar eh. Hindi na rin clockwork, doon galing yung rocket. Uy, huli ka boy. Wala siyang TP. Wala siyang buyback. Galit, nagalit. Hindi, on its way naman na yung teammates sila. And kailangan talaga nilang gawin ito eh. I mean, for Team Spirit, they can't afford to give the sages and cheese. Or else, mas dalong liliit yung window time for Team Spirit to recover. At least Larl was slowly uh, recovering. But they have nullifier. So brand dami pang dispel na meron dito for LGD. So parang they have to take advantage of blood rage from Bloodseeker. But we have NTS with a quick jump over to the Oracle. Takes him out. NTS Tito will manage 
to hide inside the to stone, hide. stone, keep him alive, <laughs> song use, Yatoro is manning up, up against four, not gonna be a good idea, Yatoro goes down, they manage to take out the blood seeker, but same goes with the Huskar, better collab <laughs> might be for his life because of this, they have another fire, but the slow is needed, collab goes down, three dead in total for the side of Team Spirit, Doom has been dropped over to the Umber, they have the control, they have the Ensir, they have the damage, it should be enough to take him out, four dead for the side of Team Spirit. Yeah, it's just Huskar dead, so ito pala yung play for, ano yun, for LDD. Just hide inside the tombstone. And uh, for Team Spirit, hindi ka naman mag-waste ng time to hit the tombstone. Same goes for Razor. So parang wala talaga mapahal ng tombstone. So uh, LDD will go for Roshan pa rin naman, even though you don't have the Huskar, you have the Riptide from Shiro. So there we have it, Roshan attempt for the side of Team Spirit. I for the side of uh, the LDD, sorry. And uh, shoutout nga pala kay uh, Kofi. Good Legaspi. Ayan. Ang standing natin, 1-0 in favor of Team Spirit. Pero mukhang uh, magkakaroon tayo ng Game 3 dahil uh, malaki na yung advantage dito ng LGD. Paganda ng Tombstone save na yun. Pero actually, out position si NTS ng time na yun. Eh. Doon napatay nila yung Oracle. Buti na lang, abot yung Tombstone save. Oh. Medyo malalim niya na yun. Pero we're trying to go for the uh, AG still. Pero it looks like taken by Shiro and wala naman mako dito si Mira. Wala. Paniske. May heal ba pag nagtatago ka sa tombstone? Wala, wala, wala. Or tago lang talaga? Tago lang. Tago. nag regen lang siya kasi meron siya. May third skill siya. Inisyo kasi parang yung punch pag kina, hindi ba nag heal Ah, wala. Wala naman yung tombstone. Masyado na Parang madugay. kasi yung mga nagtatagong spell, parang di ba puro nag heal Si Meepo nagtatago nag heal Si Punch nagtatago nag heal din. Well, Stun of the Mist, we don't have them for you. Nice dash by Lion. Stun of the Lion, see? So going for the Fresher, for the Razor. Medyo mahirap kung approach yung high ground dahil sa Rocket Fair din. Medyo annoying din yung uh, vision, damage, slows. Pero doable pa rin naman to for LGD. Medyo awkward nga lang positioning for the Tombstone since nobody is ready to protect him. But here goes the Huskar, immediately jumps in. Nice Lotus Orb to return the damage on the Huskar itself. They have the false promise to keep Collapse alive. But they've lost the Blood Secret. Saan siya na matay? Ah, sa top lane. Napatay ng Doom. <laughs> So, might be a huge opening for the side of LGD, knowing that they don't have Seeker here for Team Spirit. That was a good pick-off for New. Zero? Yep, quickie lang. Max Kiryo is the illusions here. Laurel doing his best to slow down this temp. Side of his chains, continuously spamming out. And he is still quite okay with cheese available. Aegis is still there, Shiro. 40 more seconds. Bago mag respawn yung uh, Blood Seeker. He does have a buyback, so if needed, pede naman. But we'll pop the song. Vision. Okay. Mayroon siyang shard. Kill lang so... tayo, guys. Drop the proximity mines to take out this rack and stun. Good the uh, dodge out by Lord again. Pero buyback will be used by Atara. And that is saying way too deep. Hook shot. Not a safe pop. DKP. Go to right against Atara. Has the cheese. And Atara might be in trouble for this. Needs to back off. And it's gonna be Mira instead. Life break. Have the taunt. Well, Mira goes down and she's the fine to out of this trap. Still have the Aegis. That's the build. Mira goes down. Static King collapsed over to the Oscar trying to finish him off, but he can't actually do it. Shirodito will man up. It won't matter, still has the Aegis for the Naga Siren, and they have the controls over to Yotoro, but they have the false promise. Might be enough to keep him alive. He managed to take out two heroes right now. He's back to full HP. Life Break takes out the Oscar. 3 dead for the side of LGD. So Team Spirit managed a way to fight back at the end, but at the cost of a melee rack, so I think okay for them to for LGD. Na ko yung nakabit pa nga dito, yung undying. And uh, with a static link, it should be another kill secured for the side of Team Spirit. 
na first out naman nila yung buyback nila yung Toro. Pero yung talaga yung maganda sa Pulse Promise, eh. No? As long as yung nakukuha mo yung last hit for the Bloodseeker, you're gonna be back to full HP. Pero yun nga lang, no more buyback for yung Toro. And sa kanya, mostly nagagaling yung damage for Team Spirit. So parang it's gonna be really hard for Team Spirit pagka nahuli dito si Toro. So we might be waiting another Roshan for this game. Para at least, diba, makakakit na talaga ng high ground dito yung LGD scenes at yung Spirit. Nakarecover naman na dito si Lord. Meron pa rin silang way to clear out of the waves. So, uh, back to farming na ulit. Goes for the third mentor and you shard of creep. But it will be given to nothing to save. So, one may shard na ito. Inner fire. Ang ganda na ito. The so 14k up for the side of LGD. Here goes Razor. Yeah, tama nga uh, defend lang naman for the middle. Got a clean solution. Regain some damage. Collapse. With the refresher orb, I think uh, medyo okay to. Para sa side ng King Spirit. MKB malapit lapit na rin naman na para sa Bloodseeker. Ano ba yung naging next item ng Naga Siren? Side of the Solid Fire. He's going for Bloodburn. Di ba rin naman siya kukuha ng kanyang 5th item? Yung lahat ng item niya, yung mamahalin eh. Still have the wind thing. We're 37 minutes in and we have 13k lead for the side of LGD. Waiting for next Roshan, malamang yung pangyayari dito. Just the usual. Third Roshan, possible daytime. Makuha. It's 38 minutes naman na tayo and uh, meron pa tayong 1 minute which is di pa nga rin natin alam kung ilan ba yung magiging added time Now suddenly LGD ito decided to smoke up Okay na naman itong ganitong smoke play Like after team fight parang wala naman di makukuha yung uh, sino man yung mananalo Kung sakaling mataling LGD dito wala naman sila makukuha ang Roshan afterwards So possible gusto lang nila kumuha ng uh, engagement which is yung clockwork Ano? May nasun siya si River but hindi yata siya inaabot yung nagsa reward So team spirit will also go for the smoke play and ako last to break the smoke. Mga nakita naman si Dito natin stay. We'll just blink out instead. Nakita nakita rin si Pelops dun. So we have regions available para sa ating Ember. Shiva's Guard na lang din. No? Parang maganda rin yung Shiva's Guard eh. Alin, for Ember? Ang... Wala rin kasing she was here, yun eh, no? Si Collapse. So yeah, healing reduction na rin on the Ember. Oof.
Well, uh, Rosh and the time for the infinity, they badly needed this age for Yatoro. But do they have the time? He has the slow play for LGD. Well, team fight books in over to the Razor. Lotus Sword will be used, but it needs to be careful. There goes the song coming out from the Nagasan and will be able to stop Yatoro from hitting back. And um, the Mongolian is going to get the for the follow up control. Takes out Yatoro completely down for two minutes and will be able to get more. That's going to be uh, Ember Spirit down, Razor down. Three heroes left for the set of Team Spirit. Double buyback was used, but without Razor and Bloodseeker, I don't think they might be able to turn this fight around. They even catches the Ember at the same time. Three dead. No buyback. This might be the game. Then just go straight into the base, so Agarim's blessing fire by the Mahodin LGD. It will be given to Shiro, so it's really good for LGD. With just the song, you can heal up everyone. Yep. So, and then he's just being given to the heroes of LGD, even though mag are going to rupture. There's nothing to say. Doesn't matter, it's just a song from the Naga Siren, there goes the save. It's like better to save yung meron yung LGD compared to the Oracle. Mm -hmm. But on the other side, it's going to be Mira with the crowd to push back. It's there on Shiro. Permira, Augur still out, Cooks out, and uh, gonna TP out. Pero yun nga lang, inaabot dito si Mposhka. He does have the buyback, but it's just two supports left for uh, Team Spirit. Here for Towers. Okay, they're going for the GG push. They want to end this. Crimson Guard will be used. Para lang sa damage reduction. Damage block pala, sorry. And for new, he'll blink in. Doom has been dropped over to the clocker. Who cares if you're a support hero? I just want a kill. Making sure no one is left for the side of Team Spirit to defend this. Buyback for the Oracle. This is scary. <laughs> Oracle to defend this. Well, pa boy naman yung Razor. I'm not even sure how can they hold this one. Meron tayong uh, Lane of Destiny. Lane of Destiny, ba tawag? Uh, Reign of Destiny, but G has been called finally and LGD will take the uh, game number 2 forcing out the game number 3 in this elimination round between Team Spirit and LGD. So yeah, parang ang team kampan din talaga yung naging draft nung Team Spirit. I mean, they tried again to uh, pick out the same draft, just like game number 1, but this time around, di siya mag work out even though sobrang blood seeker game na ito. For LGD, they just had better draft, they just had bigger control compared to Spirit. Siguro kung hindi offlane laser yung gawa ng Spirit, uh -huh. pwede pa siguro silang makalawan. Pero kasi parang lahat ng heroes ng Team Spirit will just stay behind. Wala talaga silang hero na kayang pumasok, it's just the clockwork. Pero once pumasok siya, na, may na natin say, it's just waiting out someone. Parang anyone for LGD, kung sino man talo na nila, easy kill na agad. Sa lang kasi yung pwede maligtas ng uh, Team Spirit with the Oracle. And like LGD having a lot of sustain, having a lot of protection for everyone. So I think out trusted lang naman talaga in Team Spirit for game number two. Yeah, then that's it. Para sa game 2 natin dito, magbabalik pa naman tayo for the game 3 ng first series natin after the short pick. Yan, thanks so much for watching guys and be right back tayo.